Evening folks, this is Vagrant, we're back with a little bit more Assassin's Creed Valhalla. In the last video, we killed a wolf, because the wolf tried to murder me. We also killed Wufa, who has disappeared. And the prospective king seemingly died as he toppled over the edge. Now, if you've seen Lord of the Rings fairly recently, which I still haven't watched, well I have, but not recently, um, <laughs> you'll know that toppling over an edge doesn't necessarily mean you're going to die because, you know, you could be Aragorn, you could be fighting some... Wargs, that's what they're called, right? Wargs. And goblins. Orcs. And you could topple over the edge and be absolutely okay. So we should still have faith, ladies and gentlemen. I say it as I do a leap of faith. Faith? <laughs> Every now and again I do like a TH instead of an F or an F instead of a TH and that's because for the longest time, I'm sure I've talked about this, but for the longest time in my life I never pronounced TH or F differently. Faith and Thaith, basically, uh, let's say the word thought as in T-H-O-U-G-H-G, I'd say thought. It just, it, it never occurred to me to do it any differently. Is that a fox? Hello. Um, I just, I just, that's just how I spoke, you know, it, it <laughs> That's all there was to it, that's just how I talked. Alright, calm down. So, every now and again, because I still have to actively think about it, it's not just like a natural reaction. Oh. That horn came from Elmenham. Valdis must have got to them. My point is, every now and again I screw it up just because it requires thinking. That's very difficult for me. Can we really do this? Hey. We can do. You leave my beast alone. My beast is a beauty. Okay, so we're gonna go attack, attack Berg. That is a beautiful, beautiful little seat. It's right there. There's a castle somewhere. I don't know where it's meant to be. Is that it there? No. There's a castle somewhere, and it's like in the sea. So I'm assuming that's what these boats are for, and we're gonna head out over there somewhere. Can we see it on the map? I'm very curious about this. Men are pouring in from across East Anglia, and our ships stand ready. Theodward's Reeve is with us. His men will be here soon. More than his, the Kingsbury Horn has inspired men all across this kingdom. We will have the army we need. It seems Oswald got what he wanted in the end. Saxon and Dane united in common cause. A pity he's not here to see it. Forces will be ready soon. Are you ready to start the assault? One of those sentences that means we can go start now, but you're not allowed to do anything else. This Our is target is Borg Castle, said to be impenetrable. Good. Let them have their false confidence. By cover of night, Baldus will lead the field at the front gates. With Ruid's men distracted, our forces move on the sea gate from the backwaters at their backs. And once we're in, we'll leave no gate closed in that castle. Ruid's men cannot be allowed to dig in further. Your longship, is she ready? She awaits her own special glory. Time for a dramatic speech. They it's like, need your words, Eivor. It's like Independence Day. Uh. Oswald was a man who did not hesitate when you sought him for favors. A man who was fair and strong. A man who gave his life for his kingdom. Honor him today. Honor his memory and fight with the same extra courage he showed. For us, for us, Now is the time. Today we rid East Anglia of Ruit's clan, once and for all. I swear they talk in sim speak, the people in the distance. Oh, look at that, that is beautiful. Yeah, I was wondering if I could have maybe gone and gathered up more men. I got the impression that we could have like gone and helped more people around and they would have come to assist in the cause, maybe. 
I don't know if that's a thing. But he seems to be happy about the number of people we have. You remember the dream I spoke of? You sailed through Helheim on a ship of fire. Here, it may come to pass. Dreams. Life. It may be they are one and the same. This is pretty cool. <laughs> this is pretty cool. I'm on board. <laughs> Get it on board because I'm on a boat. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, no, this is pretty cool. There's something nice about how the game is split up. Now, one of the problems is that there isn't like a... Good talk, April. Um, There isn't like a... There's an overarching story, but the overarching story is basically... Ready yourselves. Ruish shitstains will see us coming. We're here to take England. That's about it, you know. There's no larger overarching antagonist or anything at this point in time. There might be towards the end. However, the little mini stories mean they can all have their own sort of epic conclusion. And it's totally appropriate because they are like a self-contained chapter. It's got its benefits and detriments. Ready yourselves to brace, men. We bring Helheim to our enemies. How nice! They greet us with some of their own from the air. Arrows! They love this mechanic, don't they? Assassin's Creed loves this mechanic. Absolutely loves it. Very cool, though. Do I have to? <laughs> They're not hitting me. It seems to be like... Oh, there we go. they doing? Putting their own bloody castle down. Yo! It's like Helm's Deep by my buddy. It actually is Helm's Deep. But also, Helm's Deep, by the way, is my my favourite scene in like all of Lord of Rings. I think it is for a lot of people, admittedly. But it's my favourite scene in Lord of Rings. Okay, I should focus. <laughs> or at least pay a moderate amount of attention. Good job, lads. Do you want some help? Ah! Da, 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 da. This guy on the right just sort of watched us. Yeah! Nice. I'm sure he's an enemy. <laughs> no! I think I get too far back. I don't think I need to go as far back as I do. You forgot, I'm basically Neo from the Matrix, you silly man. Ow. Ow. Look, I just woke up, okay? <laughs> it's not fair to try to convert me like this. Killed my man. How dare he.
Really? I'm messing up so badly. Why are you running over there to hit that guy? That's Eivor's fault. Alright! Let me get this boy up first. Oh god. Right, let's give that another go. It's on fire! I don't think we want to brace for the fire arrows. <laughs> yeah, because of the oil, we need to move. There we go. I'm going in! <laughs> That's the first time I felt like I might die in a very long time. Really oiling me up. It's, it's hot, but... Okay, I'm going to focus up a little bit more. By the way, kids, Papa's angry. <laughs> oh, hey, guys. What are we up to? I'm trying to get the thing up there. Whop them all out. Just absolutely caning. <laughs> well, there's some serious work there, must be sad. Go! I wonder if I could have done that in the last one. One, two, three, four. I think four might be good. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. I'm basically walking back to the corpse. <laughs> Do I want to go a bit further, maybe? I don't know. It's, it's hard to tell. There's no indicator of uh, what is the optimum distance. Well, that's definitely working. For glory! Sort of. Damn. This farm is a fisherman are going ham. Yo, I knew it. He's Aragorn. Oh, he's gonna die. You must stop silence fool. So this is what it comes to, Wolfkist? Two Danes fighting over a filthy Saxon horse, son. This swine is your prize. Come and get him. I'm a little, little spooked, but we'll see what happens. Wait till on who gets the kill. <laughs> okay. <laughs> You know what? Screw you. Ow. I'm done with you. I'm out of here. I'm on my way, Oswald. Don't you worry, buddy. 
very gradually on my way. Don't kill him. Just leave him alone, okay? He's a good lad. Oh, he's got wolf. I put the wolf as Oswald. Hate multi-target fights. Die, you stupid little wolf. <laughs> Not words I'll ever say, really, but he does no damage. Racist. I'll have racist on my PG 13 channel. Wee! Bob. I've got to remember. That was easy. He hits weaker than most regular enemies do. I don't really know why. It's a bit odd. Oswald. You throw in with these wastrels, these arrogant swine, for what? A scrap of land and a promise of peace? Evil, no. He should be tried before God, a lawful assembly. <laughs> I won't have my reign begin with more blood spilt than is needed. Another screeching skull. This man must die for the damage he has wrought. The old laws are clear. These are Oswald's lands, to rule as king as he sees fit. Does Eivor bow to kings? To defy a king would shame him. East Anglia cannot heal without his honor intact. And what of your honor, Eivor? How much are you willing to lose? All right, Odin, calm down. The rightful king of East Anglia has spared your life today, and so it will be. <laughs> Compassion is a virtue suited for anyone, Eivor, including you. Thank you. I only did it for you, buddy, not for myself or for Ruid. Nice. I should speak with Oswald. See if he is well. Alright, good stuff. Great success has been had. I think there is loot here. I think I saw... Yeah, there's a cheeky little bit of treasure. Let's go grab that first. Wait, where is it? Oh, wait. The Saxons and the Danes have been united. And yeah, I kind of get where Odin's coming from. You know, he's being a dick about it. You know, it's... It's not the Viking way to do what we've been doing. To spare him and to think logically and blah, 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 blah. But just because there's a way that our ancestors did something doesn't mean that's the right way. Doesn't mean that's the way we have to keep doing things. Doesn't mean we can't grow and develop. They still honor the old gods, I'm sure. Blah 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 blah. But and the day if I kill him, then my entire purpose for being here kind of it kind of like undermines it a little bit, right? So you know, let's not be stupid. I'm not really a big fan of religious fervor, though, in the face of logic. So. You know, I am somewhat prejudiced here, I'll admit. I also can't see a bloody thing right. I'm trying to get... There. I'm not quite sure how. Hmm. Hmm. In here somehow, in this building. Just looking for like a smash point or a 
No, a door. Something magical like a door would be nice. Ammo is full. Oh, those magical words. Ammo is full. Not words I've experienced with my predator bow in a very, very long time. Can I upgrade my quiver? That would be really helpful. No. We need some linen, I think that is. I would run out of arrows less if I had more arrows. I mean, that certainly sounds like science anyway. Okay. Give me that loot, baby. What have we got? A nickel ingot. Very cool. Titanium leather, none of the stuff I needed, but ingots are always great. I'm not going to complain about a good old ingot. <clears throat> okay, so there's nothing else here, I don't believe. Let's go talk to Oswald. See how he's feeling about his newfound kingdom. I feel good, Eivor. Thank you for heeding me, Eivor. I know the worth of such a gesture. All this is... is like a dream. But you are not asleep. Well fought, well fought, the both of you. You came as well, old friend. If I'd known you were still alive, I would have stayed in Norwich. Look around you. A happy occasion and a glorious victory. And soon, something more grand to take place. Our wedding, my love. If you will still have me, that is. And why would I not? I fought poorly. I melted under the heat and anger of that brute, and I never- Oswald, stop. You fought with all your heart and soul. That's all you need ever do. Are the Come. brothers impressed? We have much to prepare for. A bride to wed and a kingdom to lead. What some men wouldn't give for such things. Countless men have died for them. And you, Finir, are you jealous of such things? Hardly. My heart is afire, but my body aches. I desire only a long nap. It's a mood, isn't it? <laughs> I saw a bale of hay back there. Later, Abel. But now I must see to the wounded. Then I will see you at the wedding. Aye, of course you will. Oh, I hope we get to go to the wedding. I should return to Elmenham. Yes! Where we go? Oh, leveled up. That's a lot of XP. Ah, oh, plus two skill points every time. That's very cool. Uh, I don't know why I won, though. Last time we picked up... I seem to be going over here. <laughs> so I guess I'm going over here. I don't know why I particularly wanted parry damage, but I guess I do, so... Oh, no, that's what I want! I thought I already had that. Oh, I'm a dummy. That's the, that is the skill right there that I've been looking for for the entire bloody thing. So we need to go, right, again. Okay, that's why we're going in this direction, so we can get up to adrenaline boost. I just completely forgot. I'm so lazy. Alright, let's get back to Elmenheim. North, Northwich, which is, of course, Norwich. Because they don't really pronounce it North, do they? They already pronounce it Norwich, essentially. The game has been condensed. Because Norwich is in the Northeast, it's in York. And yeah, we're going to go to London as well. And the map isn't that big. Wait, how far away is this bloody wedding? Have I gone to the wrong place? Yeah, that doesn't help. <laughs> I'll admit, that doesn't, that doesn't doesn't assist matters, does it? So what we're going to do is we're going to finish off this quest line, and then, before we go do our big map clear... Maybe we'll do a little map clearing, depending on time. <clears throat> but I'd like to start the Beowulf... And Berserker quest lines, the ones I got from the uh, DLC. I'd also like a store. Thank you. Elmenham. Hello and welcome. Hello. All right, let's sell some trash. Whoop. Always good to pick up new stock for the shop. Anything I don't like. Right? We don't need stealth damage. That's rubbish. Probably don't need fire damage. I just, there needs to be an explanation, right? So how is two fire damage ever better than three attack? Because it takes, I suppose. Don't care about poison build up. How is melee damage different than attack? 
does attack apply to ranged as well? But is it not damage? Is it a different stat? Does attack then, let's say you have 100 attack, does that equate to 50 damage? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. This will be perfect for someone else. I think I decided I'd get rid of minor runes either way, so. Let's do just that. Do you have anything of value? Very Pretty sure everything you own is trash. You would look very striking with this. Oh, I like the mossy stuff though. Do you have any haircuts? So all I got the redhead ones, didn't I? Yeah. Uh, I've got. I keep saying I've got so much money. I don't have that much money. I like the tree. How much for all of this? It's too much for all of it. Nothing else. I haven't felt that cash is must be useful at all. It's very unusual. I guess just because it isn't used in upgrading your settlement, you know. And I'm already very happy with my gear. And because we've got armor sets, you now don't want to break up your gear sets either. So a lot of reasons. You're a big boy, hello. Beautiful and worthy celebration, my lord. Thank you. May this feast set a spirited tone for East Anglia's future. In this lovely. Just like you to keep a king waiting at his own wedding. Yet I arrived in the end. A part of me worried you wouldn't. You look good, Oswald. Like a man about to marry a more powerful woman. Do I? Because I'm nervous as hell. Of all the battles a man can fight, the war against himself is the hardest to win. Piggy. Hope this is a pig at my wedding. <laughs> oh god, there's several pigs. There's four of them. About the Lord, this is their time to strike. And people aren't paying attention. I hope this just goes smoothly. Nothing's gone horribly wrong at this point, right? Everything's good. It's just gonna see the wedding and then we're gonna move on to the next quest line, right? Oh. I'm gonna brush for your hair, love, but whatever. I hereby name you man and wife, and as man and wife, I name you... Oswald of Elmenham, first of his name, the rightful king of East Anglia, with his Lady Valdis, soul, fist, and beauty of this land. You've done it, Stuart. A king now sits on the throne of East Anglia. Don't leave yourself out of this song. We did it together. Back to your dreams, then, of fire and Helheim. I lost my way some time ago. Hard to say when. I don't want to be here. I never did. This was half Dan's dream. He ordered me to see through. In my dreams, I'm sailing, remember? Wind in my beard, salt on my lips. 
I want that life again. Whether or not I find it, only time will tell. Until then, let us feast, drink, and forget our pain! Why don't you come fight with me? Come on, Finia. Enjoy the festivities. Care for a challenge? Sure. Eivor! Brother! Do you not have a name? <laughs> oh, Brothia. <Brothier. laughs> they stand so strong. Unbreakable at this distance, no? No. They are not, Brothier. My arrow's shadow would have attacked if they strike. Even after draining so much meat, succeed and you shall be rewarded. Keep your eyes open long enough to witness me, you drunken lout. It's interesting. Eivor's like a like a ghost. We're gonna be we're, like oh, okay. I got to focus. Uh, you say challenge begins. Yes, that's it. I was expecting my usual arrows. It threw me for a loop. Oh no. With everything, an easy task for the wolf kissed. Ah, <laughs> oh, barely a challenge. Impressive, impressive. Here as promised. Now go enjoy the party. Okay, uh, not bad. Hello, piggy. Can I pet the pig? I want to pet the pig. I can't pet the pig. She's like, <coughs> excuse me. She kind of like, because you imagine once the storyline ends, we may never see a lot of these characters again, right? But she came in and had such an impact on their lives, and it definitely grew to like them. Finia, Oswald, Valdis, she clearly likes and gets on very well with these people. And then she just goes. They're like work friends, but she keeps moving job, you know? She goes there for six months, she gets to know everyone really well, everyone really likes her, and then she goes to another job. It's a bit sad in a way. Let's have a drink. Your fist is without ale. Let us address that. Surely a special kind of metal <laughs> is required for drinking before the new king. A metal not unlike your own. To Odin and his endless glories. And the new king of East Anglia. May his reign be long and good. That's going to be my new line on Nice Out when my mate needs a drink. Your fist is without ale. <laughs> not bad, Wolf Kiss. I wager you couldn't drink more than me if you tried. <laughs> A fool's wager. A challenge nonetheless. What say you? Well, if you're going to keep using... I will drink you under the table. Magical invisible tankards. Are you? Let us see how you fare against the ale beast of East Anglia. And we'll make it interesting. Put your silver where your mouth is. What say you? Of course. Take all of it. I accept. Buddy, if I could bet a thousand silver on this, I would do it. Such is my confidence in my downing ability. We like to drink with Eivor, because Eivor is our mate. And when we drink with Eivor, she gets it down in eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. It would have been cool if that worked out correctly. Skull, skull, skull. Oh, he's, he's keeping up, though. Oh, no, I fucked up. Oh, no, I swore. <laughs> that doesn't matter. <laughs> I'm allowed to throw on this channel. That's the rules. Is he going to mess up? That would be nice. Oh, no. Oh, no. Messing up once is such a detriment. He's actually ahead of me. I've never been behind at this point. I can't mess this up. This has to be perfect. It's because I'm trying to get it at the edge because I know he's doing well. This is impossible. I can't tell if I'm winning or not. Oh, that was close. That was very close. It's <laughs> strong, but I am stronger. <laughs> stronger than me. You drink as well as Valdis. Now that I would pay to see. Speaking of payment, where is my silver? Here. Well earned, Wolf Kissed. Uh, I'm hammered. 
What other festivities do we have? Are any pig related? Why is he on the Oh, piggy. Oh, no, not the piggy I was looking for, really. Four represents fertility. Did you know that? Estes Freyr, what's your point? You impress me, Eivor. Your battle wisdom, your strength of character, skilled in so many ways. Yet I wonder, is there any skill of mine that I could impress upon you? Even a fool has something to teach, whether they're aware of the lesson or not. Hey, hey. But I could show you how to wield my plow sword. Uh, I'm not feeling it. Have another horn of meat, brother. It's brewed with clover and raspberry, they say. Did you hear what I... Mmm. Yes, it's good. Keep that up. Wait, did you hear? Did my brother just call me? I think he... You know I should go. Brother! <laughs> the road to Valhalla does not run that way, Finir. He's been after a while. I just... <clears throat> It's one of my problems when I play female characters in games. I'm always a little... I always feel a little bit odd about a male-female romance. You know? But, um... Further to that, I just don't think... I mean, Eivor, would she go for it, though? I mean, she probably would. The Vikings, right? They're pretty chill about this kind of thing. But he was a bit of a dick until, like, just recently. And I was a bit like, well... I think, I think I'll wait. I'm not, I'm not against the idea, because I want to see how the game plays it out, but... Then again, I feel like maybe I should have done it just so I could see how the game plays it out. On the other hand, we did get to see him get all awkward about it, which is more fun, so... <laughs> the Saxon God wanders somewhere up here, does he not? I haven't seen him. They like to say he moves with mystery. Look! The moon! It moves on trouble now. But one day it will be eaten by a giant wolf, and the night <laughs> will be black forevermore. Are you all right? I've tasted glory once again, and it was good. I'm glad to hear it. Now I always felt like Skull Party, chasing and trying to fulfill Halfdan's wishes. But now I've caught my sun and moon. I've got them and. I... I don't know. You can let them go. Sail to a further shore. My long ship's in Valhalla. Don't you remember? Fire starter. <laughs> there he goes. Come on. Let's get you to solid ground. Everything's spinny. Okay. You're very strong. Oh, excuse me. You're very large. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he's gonna come fight with us. All right, guys, come down. Sorry for this, Eivor. I've had one last glory. I should be happy. I am happy. <laughs> Thank you. It need not be the last. Not the last. <laughs> Hmm. Enough fun and games. I should see how Oswald is doing. Oh, I'm pretty hammered myself. Piggy! I want to pet the pig. Eivor, I'm about to address our guests, and I'd like you to be there. It has been a worthy ceremony so far. And have you had enough fun yet? No. I am ready to hear you address your kingdom. Good. Come, come. Join me. Friends, honored guests, we've pushed through hard times. It seems like all we've known is loss and suffering, but it is not conflict that binds us. It is compassion. May we always favor compassion, even when our enemies refuse its boon. So to my Dane friends and neighbors, I give thanks for the bravery you have shown during our collective struggles. And for my fellow Christians, May we continue standing as examples of our Lord's grace. Lights in the dark. I see East Anglia's future right here, right now. 
in all of you, Dane and Saxon alike, to our future. Still a bit soft on insults, but the king has courage. And to Eivor, without whom none of this would have been possible. On behalf of East Anglia, let this ring be proof of our loyalty to the Raven Clan and all they have done for us today. Would you have any words of wisdom for us? To the good king, Oswald! Skull! To Oswald! Skull! 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 Okay, everyone, the bridal race starts now. Remember, you all have to lose to the bride and groom. Steady all, and ready yourself for the wedding race. The king and his bride against all. My king. Oh, no. Oh, no. The sheep you left to guard me have been shorn. Oswald. King of sheep fuckers! Show your eyes! Oh. I challenge you. I accept. No square. Only sweat and blood. He may be wounded. Do not let your guard down. Let's settle this. I will bury you, Saxon. I'll take all that is yours. Come on, Oswald. Come on, buddy. You got this. Don't make me regret this too badly. <laughs> Just a typical wedding day. <laughs> Should a king show mercy to one so malevolent, so cruel, I'll not give you the satisfaction of a good death, for my god forbids such cruelty. Therefore, you are outcast. From this moment on, you have won. My life is yours. Your life is God's. <laughs> now go! Leave my kingdom and never return. I do not understand this Saxon religion. Oswald is a coin. One side mercy, the other courage. There are few like him, I'll admit. Saxon or Dane. Such a strange display. Courage and restraint like I've never seen. With all that's happened, with all the chaos ruled rule, still, Oswald found reason to spare him. It is a strange thing. A remarkable thing. From what inner spring does such kindness run? I'd like to know. With my duty here fulfilled, I now choose East Anglia. I fight for you, my king. Rise, old friend. You're embarrassing me. Be well, Finir. Your choice is a bold one. You continue huh. to surprise <coughs> Oswald of Elmenholm. Thank you, Eivor. When we first met, I made an oath. I promised you an alliance. You did. You'll have it. So long as I draw breath. Till next time, King. Imagine he just gets absolutely slapped <laughs> on his wedding day. He just dies. Oh, funny. Well, it seems the wind calls me back to Ranvi. Best tell Oh, look at all that Helheim stuff we got. Very cool. I really need to get the shipyard because I want to get uh, started on some of that stuff. Right, we've only got 15 minutes left, so what we're going to do is just uh, go do some of the quests and stuff flying around in East Anglia. I want to do the... we've got a few different quest lines to do. We've got things to do, basically. I suppose we'll put the skill points in. 
much so obsessed with. Actually, tell you what, let's count how many we need <laughs> and go from there. One, two, three. Wait, no. What? Where am I going? Up there. How do I even get there? Oh, yeah, it is there. One, two. Well, I don't know yet, so. We need that one. Just say power level 100, though. It's pretty cool. <clears throat> Some weird traditions at their weddings. Fair play to the guy. Fair play to the guy. Is it, is it, is it going to be a good kink? I'm assuming we're going to see all of them at the end. You know, we've got an alliance for a reason, right? I'm assuming it has to be called upon eventually. Which makes me think there's going to be a yet unforeseen antagonist. Okay. Okay, <laughs> this is all very unusual. I only went for that one because um, it had the statues outside, and that was the only separating factor that I could see, so. What is this? Oh. So we've got, well, I mean, I keep hearing, like, ravens in the distance. Did I do it? <laughs> no. Well, I got that wrong, apparently. I think I got the first one right. I was going to go for the one on the right again. Because it had, like, combat. Is there something about them that I should be noticing? I mean, this one took me up, so I've got to assume this is correct. <clears> Hell, <throat> oh, maybe the old dude. Maybe there's a more obvious sign that I'm missing. I'm just gonna take a little look when we get upstairs. Just thought I hear ravens, so I hear cawing in the distance, so. My inclination was for this one on the right hand side. Okay. What is the differentiating factor here, honestly? I don't have a bloody clue. What separates these three? My first feeling was the one on the right, but I can't really tell you why. God damn it! This is gonna take ages. <laughs> I just I don't know. I'm like, it's a crapshoot. I'm not I, I'm not figuring it out. I'm just going through the one that I feel good about for some reason. I should have trusted my gut on this one the first time because this I did feel initially to go for the sword and the shield one, but. I guess it must be the white flower one, right? That maybe spring. Oh, look at that background. That's lovely. But, I mean, the white flower one is the only one that has anything special about it. The other two were like fairly basic looking shrubbery. So, we're just going to go straight down the middle this time. Pray that I get it right after this again. I mean, yeah, go ahead. Let's go for it. Yes, there we go. I mean, that was the logical one for sure. We done? Please? <laughs> One day I'll figure out what on earth that was all about. Alright, what's the closest one? Let's head over to a Brislayer Farm. If anyone knows <laughs> what I was doing there, I think it is meant to be about battle and death. 
so we had like the statues of Odin and or like Valhalla related statues yeah. and then we had the seals on the ground like the aftermath of the battle and then the white flowers that spring up after the battle I think that's the idea <clears throat> honey I'm home oh Apparently a crit. Ah! Alright, where's this bloody key? Who you'll tell me? Tattered letter, Mildred, we are fleeing to Norwich. Norwich. Before Ruid's men lay waste to this place, we cannot carry everything hidden in the basements so of Ring with you anything of value we left behind. Okay. Hurry the things take all blah 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 blah. Right, where would you put the key then? Oh, it's not really there. Oh, that's a lock, what am I on about? Oh, it's over there. I still have to take issue with this, because I don't see the point in hiding the key away if you're then going to instantly tell me where the key is. You know, that seems silly to me. What I would have done is hide the key away, not let you discover it, but have the note leave a suggestion as to where that key would be. Which it kind of did, you know, if I'd seen the bodies, then maybe I thought, yeah, well, that would be the logical place for it. It's not a big deal, I'm just pointing it out. I have nickel for days. Did I fully upgrade my weapon? No, it's only like basal level, right? Yeah, yeah, we're definitely gonna, we're gonna be upgrading the axe when we go back. After all this. What I really want is some uh, linen, though, to upgrade my quiver. Onwards, wolf force! To glory! I oh, mean, yeah, that's East Anglia done. It's fun, yeah. I'm trying to think which one I liked most, but I can't really remember the others, because I've had such bloody big breaks. Oh, hello. What? Black spirits torment this land. Oh. Bloody hell. I don't know if I'm meant to be able to see it from here. Or if, no, it's below me. There's a, there must be a cave somewhere. It's hard to tell, so I need to keep scouting around with this, really. Because there's nothing here. It's definitely below me. I've been chasing that down. <laughs> it's a rabbit. But it, it glowed. Nothing else has been glowing. And I'm like, oh well, chase the rabbit then. Wait, I still need to kill rabbits, don't I? Oh, I have no arrows. Come here. Oh, my, just die already. <laughs> what are you doing? There we go, hair's foot. That's actually what I was looking for. Sweet. Although I may have already done that in retrospect. I wonder if it's... no... Somewhere there's a cave or a passageway or something that's going to take me down. Ugh. Troll curse corruption lurks here. It's going to clear by the time I get... Oh, well, it's not really, is it? Look at this place. Like misty marshes. That's very cool. Oh, this is throwing me for a loop. All right, I tell you what. There's another thing fairly close by. Let's go do that instead. Yeah. yeah. I love this. This is my kind of environment right here. Makes me happy. Probably, probably shouldn't in reality, but it does. What have we got here then? What is that symbol? I don't know if I recognise it. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. This is new. Legend speaks of treasure in these caves. The same legend that may have brought you here too. I survived with my sanity, but only just. 
Now hearken to my words. No treasure is worth your mortal soul, but if you must venture into the unknown, listen not to the voices nor the whispers, and gaze not into the void. Okay. Interesting. Not totally sure how I'm going to get down from here, I'll admit. Is it? Oh, there's a... Uh, Well, this is mildly terrifying. <laughs> Listen, not oh the red mask. Oh my god, it's big yikes! Listen not to the whispers. Gaze not into the void. For if you gaze too long into the void, the void gazes back. Hello, demons. <laughs> Maybe this will take me to the, uh... Oh! Gary, this is the troll magic, of course. That's what they're on about. This woman speaks of her child, Grendel. A cruel fate the gods have woven. My boy, my sweet little Grendel. My eyes see nothing but a helpless tiny thing. Perhaps his form is like no other, but my heart feels an immense love. Like God's love. I cannot fail him. They say he will not live long, but I'll do anything for my baby, my Grendel. So he's been born with some form of uh, malformity. Or Grendel. I guess that's why she turned to the troll magic, perhaps? To try and uh, save him? Guess we'll find out. Interesting little story here. My Grendel thrives in the face of so much. Our village, other children, his own body. My love and the grace of God are all he needs. We will move away from the rest. He needs not their fearful looks, their vile taunts the evil threats. Oh god snakes! Jesus. Oh, I was looking at the distance like, oh god, what's found me? <laughs> Grendel sins off a god alone to judge. My simple boy knows not his own strength. Forgive, it, forgive him, Lord, as he knows not what he does. My duty is to help him thrive, and I shall. I love him, I love him so, my sweet little boy, my Grendel. This is very unusual. Oh, whoa, you cheeky little... That pit must have thrown people for a loop. Well, this is terrifying. I mean, there's a key symbol, <laughs> but I can't seem to find anything. Yo, if you tell me this is the... Lo but there's no key! <laughs> oh, this is very spooky. Oh, what's going on? What is this quest? I'm gonna go back up. I might have to reload a save or something, I'm not sure. I'm worried that I'm gonna have to kill Grendel. <laughs> That's my current worry. Alone I rot in inky black, the end of a shadow maze. In the hand of one born well, I blaze with boundless flame. <laughs> what is this place? God only knows, Eivor. God only bloody knows. What? What? Wait, what? I suspect I've missed something. Maybe it's the key. I guess. 
but the key didn't work. I don't know if it's meant to be sad or scary. It's kind of both. I feel for the woman and her Grendel. I also don't want Grendel to try to murder me because it seems like Grendel has killed before. Ow. <clears throat> oh, hello. No, I don't care about that. Surely, oh, hello, I don't care about you. <laughs> oh, hello. Um, I suspect whatever this key leads to. Well, this non existent key is something I need. Okay, I'm just gonna do a quick little save and reload, and hopefully that fixes it. Thankfully, it should be uh, pretty quick since I'm running on the SSD. Is that one? <laughs> uh, no, not 25 hours. Wait, how are they both saved at the same time? But this is 26 hours in. Very weird. Very peculiar. I'm so confused. It's not like it's below me or anything. It's right here, but it's it's not. Am I missing something in the area or Ah, there's bodies everywhere. Okay. I don't really know what to do, so we're gonna end it there. I'll do a little research. I will wander around, try to figure it out, and uh, we'll do we'll pick this up at the start of the next video. Thank you very much for joining me. I'll see you lovely folks next time. Cheers much love as always. Bye bye.